watching Be Inside TV. I'm Shamari of Be Inside TV, and I'm here at the Tribeca Cinema Gallery to celebrate the New York premiere of the Tribeca Film Release Slate. I spoke with the cast members and film directors on the red carpet. I'm here with Jack Schaefer. If you heard of a talented director, you need to see the film Timer, which is going to be released and you'll be able to see it, yeah. especially here at Tribeca, which is what we're celebrating today. Now, your film is so funny. Oh, thank so you. So funny. Thank and it's, as a writer and a director, tell us how you came up with the concept and a little bit about the film. Yeah, um, well, it's about a device that counts down to the moment that you meet your soulmate. Um, and I came up with the idea because my brother was getting married and my mother had one of those countdown to the big day clocks, you know, that you program in the date of the wedding and it tells you you have 72 days to get your caterer. And so I thought it was so great to have one of those for my love life. And, and that's, that's where the concept came from. As far as the distribution of the film, it's been picked up by Tribeca Film. Tell us about that feeling and what does this mean for your film exactly? Yeah, well, doing our video on demand through Tribeca is fantastic because they, they really understand the film. They, they were so instrumental in making it a success at the festival last year. We sold out all our shows. They had to add shows. You know, so they're a fantastic partner with which, you know, to do this platform, to do video on demand and to really get the word out. And they're so great with their online marketing and, and their campaigning in that way. So it's just been perfect. And then we did we did two special screenings here at the Tribeca Cinemas and, and there were people who came who came to the who saw it last year at the festival and they, they came this time with their friends and you know, their boyfriends and girlfriends and, and that's so gratifying and that's because Tribeca gets the word out there, you know, and, and they take care of their filmmakers. As far as Tribeca, how I know you you spoke just briefly about it, but there are not even words, especially when you speak to the filmmakers, yeah. that they can say to just express themselves as far as how instrumental Flybecker has been as far as helping them along with their project. Yeah. Do you have any words that you would like to mention? Oh my gosh, yeah, no, there's there's so many words that I would like to mention. Yeah, I mean, before we got into Tribeca, we had a movie that we loved, but it, there was no guarantee that it was going to have a life. And then as soon as we got into Tribeca, that's that's when the then the film sort of like goes from a, from a chrysalis to a butterfly, you know. It's so cheesy, but it's really, really true. And then that's how, you know, my movie got exposure and I got exposure. I, I found my manager and, well, really, my manager and my agents found me because of Tribeca. And the film, you know, has had this amazing run in all these festivals because it started at Tribeca. So yeah, Tribeca is the root, Tribeca is the heart, and and I owe so much to, to these people and to this amazing festival. Wow, Tribeca makes that <laughs> magic happen. It's true, it's absolutely true. Yeah, I can't say enough glowing things about Tribeca. Since the film came out, actually at the Tribeca Film Festival yeah. since that that release yeah. what has been the life of the film thus far yeah well we've been we've been in about 15 festivals all over the world domestic and all over Europe we're going to be in uh, Brazil and Korea this summer and so it just that's that's what Tribeca kicked off was our was our festival run and then our our um, our distribution began two weeks ago in Los Angeles so we're in the distribution leg starting with an LA run a New York run the VOD and then our DVD will be in June so I'm gonna dub you the hardest working woman in show business <laughs> what have you been up to I mean I've been I've been traveling with the movie like crazy I've been I got stuck in Amsterdam at a festival because of the volcanic ash I mean hey. it's been nuts but it's great because my movie's a sci-fi movie and that's it's kind of a sci-fi thing that happens, so so it's been good. But yes, it's been a lot of work, and, and we're, we're almost done, and now people are, are really seeing the film in, in homes all across the country, and you know, that's the best part. <laughs> 